Hey guys, welcome back to Hannah and Reacts, and today I'm going to be watching Angel Season 1, Episode 6. It's called Sense and Sensitivity. Um, I think this is a Kate episode. I just saw her name in the summary. Sorry, y'all. Um, but because in the guide, the episode, I'm not able to download it onto my com computer. I'm just going to be watching on Amazon Prime. Hopefully they have the version that y'all like to see. Otherwise, I'm just going to have to do some editing to make it line up. Okay, let's get started in three, two, one. I would not want Kate on my ass. Like, she would not let you go. Did you see that flying kick? That's what I'm saying. Sorry, I guess I have a problem expressing myself verbally. It's something I spoke Damn, police brutality, y'all. You're gonna come to the station and answer a few questions, remember? Oh! What the fuck is that? Oh my ew. What is that? It's in the sewers with you too. Okay. Am I wrong in thinking that a Oh, there's a whole other net. Okay. Is generally considered good form when requesting a dismemberment? Well, he appreciates us in his own unappreciative way. An insensitive. Sure, he's polite to the helpless and the oh, downtrodden. Oh shit! He the uh, people who matter the most, you know? Can you say Cordy? Cordy, turn around. His name's Tony mm. Papazian. Street name Little Tony, and he's a bad guy. We've already got an indictment against him for the murder of a county supervisor. Just one problem. We don't know what's in the subpoena. You can't find him. He's still in the city. We're pretty sure, but all my sources are dry. You know, thank you so much for going through the coroner reports because I can imagine how not fun it is to read about you know coroner stuff blame the weebies this guy <laughs> clearly has anger management issues you've got victims and victim parts washing up all over the southern California coast well he said I should say something you know just a few words to mark the occasion seeing as your oh that's her dad it. that'll be fine he's so don't go to any trouble. Dang. It's no trouble, really. That hurt. And I that's not even my dad. Like, what the hell? Thanks. He's so impersonal. And don't forget to water my plants. Sure thing. And talk to him. They like that. I know that guy. Where's he from, y'all? The guy, the black hair oh. guy. It's exciting, isn't it? I just love boat trips. Who's the mook? Herb Saunders, Baltimore. It's Herb Saunders. Gripes, the freeways you people have in this Why town. Why are you dressed like that? It is not daytime. <laughs> oh. oh my god. He actually kind of looks good. What? Angel never, like, looks bad. They was on his ass. Like, she said, all units. <laughs> that thorn is about to be removed. Permanently. Oh, her. is copy of our petition to the courts to transfer our client out of this precinct. What for? For his own safety, Lieutenant. Oh, is he afraid to stay with us? Do you need a nightlight? You got a pretty mouth, Katie. That was a threat. <laughs> I want that stricken from the Stricken record. from the record! Is under I want to have my shit abuse, suffered recorded. Suffered at the your officers and an as yet unnamed assailant we believe was in league with Detective Lockley at the time of the arrest. Hmm. Just a feeling I got. Mm-hmm. I just find it endlessly fascinating how your instincts are so highly attuned when it comes to boring old evil, but you have mm -hmm. yet to make any mention of these new shoes. Oh yeah, that's why she was doing that. I was like, I was about to say, Look, they kind of cute. Know, <laughs> women's shoes, men just don't. <laughs> right shoes, new. So you were right. Papazian's plan is. He noticed you hear? immediately. Papazian's plan is something. But he like her. Johnny Red says, quote, Papazian's plan is something. I thought he might be planning something. See, you're how you grew up. Any siblings? Six brothers. And what was that like? I learned to hit back pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Your brothers went kind of hard on you, huh? Where were your parents? That's just my mom. Is there something that you always wanted to say to your mother but never could? Oh, wow. Wolf of my heart really got Will someone good. <laughs> Kate? Damn, Kate, why you ruin it? I'd like to share something. We'd like to hear it. No, I don't really. Afraid? 
Something wrong? Kate, I think you may be in real danger. Okay, the relief part's done. Look, I've heard some things. I don't know the specifics yet, but I think Papazian's taking a contract out on you. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna stay on He's this. He's really acting out, isn't he? Well, yeah. He wants you dead. Well, I get that. I'm just saying that he must be in some kind of pain to have to strike out at others in that way. Are you okay? God, listen to me. Suddenly, I'm Dr. Girl, Bob. where's... Next thing you know, I'll be talking about... Where's my key? ...my inner child. <laughs> this is Angel. He's a friend. Angel, this is my father. Hello, Mr. Lockley. Congratulations. For what? All I did was live this long and I get shot. Why do you do that? Mm. Do what? Pretend important things don't matter. So, Angel, how long have you been seeing Katie? We're, um, you're pretty new friends. Well, good to see you around with a man. I was starting to wonder if she didn't lean in another direction altogether. All right, He's everyone. He's trash. After Mom died, you stopped, you know. It was like you couldn't stand the sight of me. Her face, her eyes looking up at you. But big girls don't cry, right? Big girls don't we cry. We said gone, gone. Her mom was soft and she smelled like macaroni and cheese and she would she'd pick me up on her lap and she'd rock me she said she wanted to keep me for herself <laughs> what's going on here i hear what you say but i need to find my daddy now Detective Lockley, you're not exactly yourself at the moment. Why don't we all just help each other? Right, by staying here together. Well, we could do that, but see, I have this personal problem. You're gonna share till dawn? <laughs> and I don't oh, want to come off as insensitive, fuck? but Girl. if either one of you try and stop me, I'll have to blow you the crap away because I'm gonna find my dad. Okay, let her go. Let her go. Ain't nobody get a shot for you, okay? What were your parents like? My parents were great. It tastes a lot like chicken. Not like oh, chicken now. Sorry, I was so sensitive, George. It don't work on vampires. I hear what you're we didn't saying. need to know all that, okay? I don't think you're listening to your mugger's feelings at all. Mugger. You see, you see, no. <laughs> she's totally lost it. She looks like she's ready to do some damage. Okay, I think someone needs a hug. Huh? Angel. He ain't gonna do We're shit. Closed. You're the police. You, you can't close. Why not? Haven't we done enough? It's always find this, rescue that with you people. See how you like it. I to express that's your job, though. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's your job. We should leave it open. Would you come on? What's the magic word? No, I don't believe Ugh is the magic word if one would call it a word, and even then, certainly not a magic one. Uh, we don't have time for this. And there's always time to be considerate of others, Cordelia. Oh, please. See? It's so hard now, was it? <laughs> I, you finally had it over I swear, it almost feels like he's trolling them. Thought you were smarter than little Tony. Uh, now, <laughs> why don't we all just sit down together and process this? Seems that sensitivity training I paid for really took. Oh, Nancy boy. It's up. I forgot they're okay. also very aggressive for some reason. Yes. You telling me? You shot up a precinct and attempted to murder a police officer in full view of witnesses. We can't risk that kind of exposure. You're the one set this thing up. We opened a door for you. The point yeah. is for you to walk through it, not blast your way out. The senior partners feel you've become a liability. Our relationship is terminated. Angel. As is this phone call. Dang, he's so cold. No, don't say anything. You make an idiot out of yourself. Embarrass me in front of the guys. You don't bring that up ever again. As far as I'm concerned. Wow. It didn't happen. He... Like, she's trying so hard to have a connection with this man that don't want it. Like, he's a deadbeat. He's a deadbeat. Okay, I don't care if he was there the whole, whole childhood. He's a deadbeat to me. That's what he sounds like to me. Like, he need to go on somewhere. Anyway, y'all, this was actually a funny episode. Um, and I really enjoyed it. 
besides Kate's dad, like he can go kick rocks. Um, so please like and subscribe, check out the Patreon for full access, full exclusive content. Um, and I'll check you guys out next time. Bye.